is either going to make or break my makeup. So I got my hands on this Chic Lamp Powder. Let's test it out. I've already set my under eyes so they would increase with my MAC Press Powder right here. Open it. Okay, there's something right here. Okay, so this is what it looks like inside. Refreshing setting powder. And I'm thinking if I should set normally and then use this powder or not. Put a little bit, it looks so fine and a little gritty in my eyes. I don't know. And then I'm going to go in with my, um, and then a little bit here. Wait, why is it wet? Why, why is it wet? And I just put it right here and look what happened. <laughs> it, it feels so wet. Okay. You know what? Just to be on the safe side, I'm going to set with my Laura Mercier setting powder and then we would use this because what? Why is it wet though? Interesting. I would see people pour water, but I wasn't sure what it was. But it says it's a refreshing powder. So let me just go in with my Laura Mercier first. Moment of truth. I'm going to use the wet powder. Gosh, I don't even think I should put it behind my hand. So let's just get into it. I'm going to start right here. Ooh. Okay. I don't know. Wait, let me do this way better. I'm going to tap the excess. Oh, wow. So basically, it is more or less like a brightening powder. So from what I'm getting from here, it's more or less like a brightening powder, like an under eye brightening powder sort of you know, vibe that, that is going for. And I'm here for it. This is something that if I want an extra, you know, boost, like with this look, I'm definitely going to go in for. This is how it looks like with natural day light. And it's not bad, honestly. I did go in light-handedly because I could see a sheen that I didn't like. However, it turned out really nice. I was so shocked when it was wet <laughs> because from the reviews I've been seeing people pour water on it not it having like a sort of wet feel if they do come out with like loose powders like normal loose powders that had that feel to it I would definitely purchase it because I like the feel honest review do you really need this no you don't need it however if you do get your hands on it please set with your normal setting powder or loose powder before you go in with this and a light hand with this one